Hey music fans, as a roadie I had this great opportunity to tour with all these bands. I wrote a book about my experiences on the road and it was the number one new release on Amazon and Bios and it's now sold millions of copies on Kindle. I'm Joel Roadie and this is my podcast, Party Like a Rockstar. I just watched uh, Taria perform this song from the end of an era show and blew me away, right? It was just, it was just amazing. (laughs) And so I'm doing a bit of a dive here. I'm going to see other performances. I found this one. This is live in Vancouver. It looks like it's with Floor. And so let's jump into this and hopefully I get a little bit of that magic that I just saw a few moments ago. So, so good. This is going to be good too. It's in Canada. How bad can it be? Canadians are awesome. Let's do this. that all I need entwined in finding you all day ever felt a way without me my love it lies so deep ever dream of me
seem to be a little bit of a lighter performance than the end of an era performance. So, and I'm comparing it to end of an era because I literally just watched it. So uh, the keyboards, they didn't have this much uh, power. I don't know, as much hitting behind them. It was more melodic and chill. It was, and, and I think this is all arranged because of Flora's voice, different voice. So, and I'm totally speculating here, bring it on if I'm an idiot and saying dumb stuff. Bring it on, bring it on. I thought I heard some extra uh, bass drum in the beginning as well from Kai. Uh, it was like this low down, like deep bass hit that I didn't, uh, I didn't hear in the end of an era version, but I also wasn't focused on it. So now I want to go back and see actually, but I love that growl of that bass drum. That was really, really neat. Did you notice as soon as Marco came in and sang a couple words, I'm like, ah, oh. <laughs> I get so excited when that dude sings. I love it. But I know that when he sings, I, I love his voice. I think it's great. But I know Flora's going to come in real soon and she's just going to bang something out like really quick here, do something amazing. And, and it was. So that was a cool version. But it didn't have the same like rock energy as End of an Era. It was more of a, we've been playing this for a while and this is an amazing song vibe, I think to me. So. I think they did bring a little bit of that magic I was talking about to Canada. You know, how could they leave it at home? They wouldn't do such a thing. So let me know what you guys think. Did you hear differences? Are the differences that I'm pointing out in my head and they're made up? <laughs> What'd you think? What'd you think? So good performance though. Good performance. Why don't we jump into another one? Let's check out another version of Everdream. I'm going to do some looking and see what I can find. <laughs> Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the show. I now have a Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Discord, and even a Patreon. The Patreon you can join for as little as one buck. The handle on all of them, it's of course, Joel Rohde. I'll see you guys on the next one.